Jack here, and I've got a special lamp stand for heat lamps for terrariums, fish tanks, or other reptile tanks that need heat lamps. So this is a stand that goes underneath the tank and reaches up around over the tank that allows you to hang different various kinds of lamps on top of the tank. All right, so open up the box. Yeah, go ahead and do this. It's just a very simple cardboard box. And full disclosure, this was sent to me for free for this video. But as always, that won't change anything that I say. There's four of those thumb knobs. And then we're going to just pull out the rest of the metal pieces here. Like so. There is a little bit of assembly required with this stand, but that's okay. There's some little instructions. Oh, there's the instructions couple other pieces. All right, so once we have all the pieces, we're gonna get rid of the cardboard box. And what we have left is the instructions. These are gonna be really helpful and important to use when you're setting this up. It's numbered all the steps, so do follow the steps in order. And then we've got the base, a few different pieces of metal, and the thumb screws themselves. We'll go ahead and take these out of the cardboard. We don't need this anymore. And we'll go ahead and set this up. There is a little card right there with some information and the actual hook hanger here for the light. This is the part that actually hooks onto the light, so we'll set that aside. We don't need this card for now, so we'll set that aside. So the first step is to take the base. It's a little bit dusty from the package, but here's the base right here. Step number two is to attach accessory A to cover this protrusion. So accessory A looks to be this thick bar here with, both, with the screws on both ends. So we're gonna go ahead and figure out how to attach this. Looks like we wanna do it like so. So we'll slide it on there. And what this is gonna do is allow us to put a thumb screw right here. So the third step is to take one of these thumb screws and twist it in here to tighten down the base. So we'll go ahead and tighten like this. Step number four is gonna to be to add uh, accessory B onto accessory A. Accessory B is this piece right here. We'll go ahead and insert it in like so. And the nice thing is this is height adjustable. So depending on how high you need the stand to be, you can do that. So do keep that in mind. You can adjust the height here, but I'm gonna go ahead and leave it like this and insert the screw as needed. We'll go ahead and tighten this down. All right, that's there. Step number five is to attach the thumb screw. We just did that. Step six is to add this angled piece here to the top. We'll go ahead and do that like so. And then one more thumb screw to hold it in place. We'll twist like this. This is step seven. And again, there's another spot here where height can be adjusted. And then here is step number eight is going to be this piece goes on right here. And the final thumb screw will go right here. That's step nine. Step 10 is to attach the light from this little hook right here. You do have one of these if you need to attach it to the light to be able to hang it. We're gonna move over to the turtle tank now to set this up. All right, so here is the mount for the lamp and the whole stand right here as we put it together. We're gonna to slide it under this side of the tank and attach the lamp to it with this little clip here. So I'm gonna set it on the table here and do my best to lift and insert this under the tank. You might need to ask for help if it's heavy. We'll see what I can do on my own. All right, so I had to put the camera down and have my cameraman help me with this part because the tank was quite heavy, but we were able to lift the tank and slide the base of the stand under the tank. And you can see it's elevating this lamp nicely up off the tank. Now we do not have a second one for this lamp, but that would be pretty nice if we had both of these up. It would make opening and closing the lid of the tank way easier for feeding or just to touch the turtle or to, you know, clean the tank and whatnot. But take a look at that. Nice and convenient, works with any kind of lamp. We had to use the holes in the lamp there to attach it here. So just make sure that this is compatible with your lamp. Otherwise, any kind of clip on your lamp will probably work with this hook. So I would say that it's compatible with just about any lamp, but you might have to make a hook yourself or get a light with a hook or attach a hook on your own. But you can see there's nice little slots for the cable, which allows you to cleanly route the cable all the way down the stand and down to power. So all things considered, I'm really happy with this adjustable heat lamp stand for reptile tanks or other types of tanks. If you're looking for a stand like this one, I do recommend it. Thanks for watching, and I hope this helped your purchase decision.